All right, so go ahead and get started with the box that it came in. I just went ahead and covered up my um, address or whatever, but it just says soap box. So open it up, and this is pretty much what you see. I did already look at the items, um, so they're a little bit different. I'm going to go ahead and zoom in so you can get a better. Okay, so here we go. This is just actually a coupon code just right here on the side. I'm just going to cover that part up so that I, I can receive $10 off of a future order. And then this is what you get that helps you kind of look and see what is in the entire box. So you can see everything that's on here is actually what was in the box. So fortune cookie soap, fall soap box. I'm going to turn it over and then just kind of go um, in order so you guys can see. So pick of the patch personal um, space. It says this is what that is, personal space. And it is basically um, an odor neutralizer. And I'm going to go ahead and smell it. I do get pumpkin, but it seems a bit as it may be like um, almost is not completely pumpkin. Like you kind of smell the other things in it. I'm going to actually spray it and see. Okay, so once it's sprayed and kind of mixed in together, it is a very light pumpkin scent. Um, it kind of reminds me of my pumpkin cupcake, um, what's it called, candle from Bath & Body Works that I love so much. So there is that. going to be insert cookie cutter name here, bath oil. So I thought it was really neat and cool that they sent the bath oil in this. A lot of times with bath oil, no matter where, what brand or anything like that, a lot of the times it leaks because oil... It's just oil so it tends to leak so they sent it in this burlap and it really helped because as soon as I opened it I realized that it was a little leaky it wasn't like huge you can tell like nothing has actually come out of the bottle itself um but excuse me and I polish on my hands but um it was just leaky so I thought that was a really really cool thing I don't know if they always do that or if it's just for show since it's kind of like fall decor but I thought it was a really really nice idea so here's the bath oil. I'm a little bit as hesitant as to try this in my bath. I normally don't like using just pure oils. I like to kind of like not use so much. I think I'll just put a dab or two in because I'm still worried about it clogging up my drains. But like I said, it's called Insert Cookie Cutter Name Here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and smell it to see. To me, this smells like... I do get cookies. I get sugar cookies is what I get from here, which is super cool. That's that's really amazing. I'm always in awe as how as people can, you know, give different scents to different kind of things. But the, it does smell like a sugar cookie. So that is cool. Okay, so moving on is your insecure. Don't know what for fall milk bath. And um, I love, 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 love their milk baths. Um, I had one that I don't think it was fall, I think it was maybe for the summer that I used all up. It's so great. And I'm a little bit afraid that this is not going to be enough for my bath. I'm going to see. Um, because I want to try and use these things without using my normal bath stuff. So I can test them out let you guys know. But I know already that I love their milk bath. But like I said, I love their names too. How cute is that? You're insecure, what for? And it says hashtag fall. So and basically with their milk bath, it's like little salts. Um, but they're like chalk looking. It says that it's supposed to have cinnamon in it, so I do get a little bit of cinnamon, but I don't really get a donut. But cinnamon is good. It's not too overbearing by any means. I think because it's a milk bath and it's more on the creamier side, that maybe that has something to do with it. But there's that. So the next one is I am what I am, said the marshmallow whipped cream. Now, I am not a fan of whipped cream, and I've never had their whipped cream because I just... I feel like my skin and what I like for my skin is really, like very very like direct and I know and I don't like whipped creams because they tend for to me to be not not be moisturizing enough for me so um, I'm gonna be interested in trying this out to see if I actually do like them normally the only like whipped product or anything like that that comes in any kind of container like this is the body shop that I like well and Bath and Body Works but still um, so let that focus So, I don't know, maybe it's supposed to taste like kind of, or smell like Thanksgiving more so. You can see it's extremely thick. It's not moving at all um, by me tapping it or anything like that. 
No, oh, I got it on my mouth. That's disgusting. Hmm. I don't get anything. I don't know. I'm not like one that can be like, oh, I smell marshmallow. So maybe that's the problem because I can't smell a marshmallow. Um, I'll use what is actually in the cap to kind of let you guys know. So it's very thick. I will say that. Um, you can kind of see. It's very, very thick. Wow. That actually is really, really nice. Um, I'm going to see if I can smell it now. I still don't get anything. The next one is Leaf Pie Bath Fizzy. So here's that. Um, and you can see on there kind of there is a leaf on there. And then there's just, just a bath fizzy, fizzy. So basically you put it in and it fizzes in your water. I've shown you guys this in my bath several times. Not this exact one, but just remnants of it. Um, and this is supposed to be notes of apples and acorns. I don't know what that's supposed to be like. You guys know I'm not a big fan of apple. So I'm going to smell it and see. Um, but I don't see me liking these scents combo. Yeah, it's very apple-y. It's not bad, but I guess I'm not just an apple person. But you really do get a nice apple. I wouldn't say apples and acorn if they're really close to, if they're really trying to make acorn an actual scent. I wouldn't say it smells like acorn. I just smell apples entirely. But maybe once I use it, I will use it because I do, like I said, I do want to review everything. Um, but I, I, just, I just get the apple, so. Next is what we have here. It's cranberry plus apple um, wax tart. So, I'm guessing this is what that is. Um, yeah, it doesn't say anything. It just came like this. And I don't even know actually what this is. I mean, it's supposed to be an actual scent like my normal wax tarts it does smell very good very much so like fall it just says two on there that's weird maybe so maybe it is like a scented wax tart next is autumn days and this is the fortune cookie soap stupid but here's the fortune actual fortune cookie and then you can tell it has well if it'll focus there we go you can tell it has a little fortune in there which i'm gonna wait to, until i actually like use this or do anything with this box in it in its entirety before I actually use or read my little fortune. But it is very pretty. It has little leaves in there. That's super cute. And it's rubber. So I'm not sure. I think it's a soap though. It smells very good. Mm. Yeah. So yeah. That smells really, really good. And um, just a little, like a... It's very like soft too. I don't know if you can tell. But I can focus. There we go. I can push it and whatnot. So the last thing on this little... Um, card is Indian Summer OCD Hand Sanitizer. Now, I think from watching other um, videos about just this box, I believe that they always send a hand sanitizer. If nothing else, a hand sanitizer. I think I've seen other things from them, maybe, but I know I remember people constantly talking about them. So this is the one that um, I got in this one, and this is supposed to be... Notes of blueberry, woods, and musk. That's a little weird, but um, this is just what it looks like. I'm going to smell it really quickly. Let's see. Actually, I'm going to open it all the way. You know what? It smells good. Hands that are tizer is one of those things where you, you for, for me at least, I can't always judge what it smells like because... The actual, okay, come on, focus. There we go. Um, the actual hand sanitizer all, and the scent of it um, being so strong, it always takes out the smell. It does smell very good. I can't tell if I can smell anything in it. Um, I was hoping that I'd be able to smell the blueberry. I feel like I smell the woods and the musk the most, although it's not bad smelling. Um, that is everything that I received in this fall soap box. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um... I will be back a little bit later to let you guys know what I thought of all of the products. Um, and I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to enjoy almost all of these things, though. Um, seeing it as they're very, very, very great scents. I love fall. I love everything about fall. Pumpkin patches and just that 
the amazing aroma that comes with it so I know I'm going to enjoy it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to talk to you guys next time. Um, please subscribe. See you guys soon. Bye.